All right, what's good, everybody, man? What's up, man? I just wanted to talk to y'all about um, the alerts I wanted to do today. And, bro, this market is about patience, man. You gotta, you gotta be calm and collective about the market, man. You just gotta wait on your moves. And a lot of things is gonna happen. You know, sometimes you gotta rush into the market. Sometimes you just gotta chill, bro. Wait, wait till your um, setup is there, man. That's what, um, most people usually do, they, they are rush the process. Sometimes you gotta wait the process, man. You can't play 24 seven in this game, man. You gotta wait for the right shot, you feel me? As in like, so say if you trying to like take a three or something like that, you feel me? Um, you know, you're probably not the best, you know, hezzy hezzy, but you got the best catch and shoot. You can't, can't do all that. Y'all probably don't know what I'm talking about, but let's get it. All right, yo, yo, so we here, man. We here live with the charts, and I just want to show y'all the ways of patience, setting up right, and let me move up a little bit. I can't really see, you feel me? And, you know, just waiting your turn, and it's going to come, man. Let's, let's check it out, man. So let's just do breakout. I just want to make it simple, because breakout is an easy strategy anyone can follow, so I'll just do, like, a little breakout video. Like, just say you wanna, you're a breakout trader. You feel me? Like, so say, I set an alert here, and then I set another one right here. So, if it breaks out, you feel me? You got your alert, like say, if it hit your alert, ding, 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 it, it hit your alert. We just going with the flow. Like, say if it breaks here, we would put one down to here, or oh, probably like to a little bit down here. And we try to get a one on one. Oh. One on one, one point five. That's a good take to over ratio. You feel me? We will lose that bang. But say if it break out again, we will take another one. You can't be scared to take another one. You're a breakout trader. So take that another one, bang, and that's your setup right there. You feel me? And say if it broke out right here, you set the alert. Bang. Like you want to trade right here. Bang. You wait. Let me let me answer that for y'all. So say you answer right here. You probably go on a smaller time frame. You feel me? Ah, uh, that's why I ain't like it. You lose it. But y'all know y'all get the point. We go on a smaller time frame. You will find a a trade with a little probably like a two point. So at least one point five. You could take fifty, eighty percent partials and leave a runner. You feel me? That runner power would have would double your money even with that small runner you feel me anyways and that's the key alert so these alerts is usually orange you set an alert like right here and it would just bang it set an alert you it could come through your phone it could come um through your laptop it could come with your tablet apple watch whatever man but it come, and that's why it's so good, because you don't want to stare at the market 24-7. Sometimes you probably on the go, you busy. And I'm showing y'all a quicker way. You can at least look at the market at a point you really want to look at it instead of the market fluctuating and just doing this move. You don't really want to sell there. You want to wait for your setup. You feel me? Your breakout ain't there yet. You wait for it. Do patience and you will go good. You break out right here, what? Boom. We got another breakout trade. Let's just see, bro. I'm giving y'all examples. You wait. You don't. You don't. I like even if you don't smoke. You don't try to sell outside of here. You can even go on smaller time frames and go like this. Look, smaller time frames. You waiting for the breakout. Like even if it's a, you feel me? I'll do it right here because there was a big move. Big move. Wait for the breakout. You sell. You, you put the alerts here and here, you feel me? You probably would have bought for loss. Let's be realistic. Like, let's see. But some, there's other ways you could tell where the trend is going, but we just doing, you feel me? We want to go back up here, realistically, and probably like to downhill. Uh, we can go a little bit up. Your stop loss got to be. Yeah, we like right here. And we would have lost. Simple. And then now, we go and break out. We can put one right here. And look. Left a runner. Leave a runner. Come on. We probably would have still been in that runner. We probably would have closed out somewhere up here. If the runner came back. But 
hey man, it went downhill, man. You feel me? So your wins always gotta be bigger than your losses, and you're gonna get more wins than losses. So you're gonna be profitable. You feel me? And um, alerts really help you, man. So that's all for today, man. I just want to tell y'all about the alerts. I really want to talk more in depth about the alerts, but that's another time, man. I just want to get y'all detail by detail, man. And yeah, man. Like the video, comment, subscribe, man. Tell me if you use alerts, man. I I love the alerts. Like I ain't gotta look at the chart. I can be like, oh yeah, it look yeah. Even if that chart it don't look good, I'll set alerts in here. You know, you ain't gotta stay at the charts twenty four seven. So yeah, I'm out.